Oh my word, what happened to you, baby? Hi friends, today I am at the Heart of Ohio Antique Center. It's the biggest antique mall in the state of Ohio. It might be the biggest antique mall in the Midwest. I'm not quite sure, but it's I think it's 185,000 square feet of antique bliss. Look, there's the cult of vintage right there. My buddy, Jeffrey and Barbara here. Laura and Mary Beth, Pat Burke Pines are here. Mark is here. Emma is coming here. So we're gonna go in. We're gonna check this place out. We're gonna see what we can find today. Let's go. All right, so we just walked in and it's massive. Wow. Oh, I like this little guy. He is $46 for that little egg cup. He's going, what? What is here? Oh my gosh. You get a wagon? <laughs> Jeffrey, hop in. I'll give you a ride. Michael, we can share wagons. We'll sh we're going to share a wagon. All right, we put the wagon away because the wagon was just too much. So we got... We got a basket instead. So, and we've got, look, say hi to Michael. I'm filming Michael filming. <laughs> All right, oh my gosh, I have this little picture here for $18. Now, one thing I do wanna look at is our sale. Sale signs because there's an antique show in town. So I would hope that the antique mall would take advantage of a lot of people coming in here from different areas and maybe having a little bit of a sale. We can hope. So here we've got the um, the penguin ice buckets. This one's brushed. This one's a lot different than the one, the aluminum, the spun aluminum that I've seen before. And then we've got little babies. Little salt and pepper babies six dollars and everything that I'm going to buy today I am going to show you so oh here we have a little I've seen these several times today the little glass owl with the bulging eyes we've got some paperweights okay I'm gonna keep on we're gonna keep on keep on keep on keep on dancing all through the night it's a great thing to look through the cases though you know it's not everything is going to be you know highly expensive in the case the cases are an easier or a less expensive way of selling your things oh my gosh I love that toy chest look at the graphics on that I myself just prefer I, I like to pick things up and touch them, but they do have, I think they have bells here where you can ring. And if you see something in the case, someone will come and give you a help. Oh, there's a, some, a Murano clown for $45. That's not a bad price. Oh, I see, I see something I want, Mark. Go get that man. Seriously. I see a cat trinket. That I want for $14. Oh my gosh, look, there's booby cups up there and they put masks on them. Get the cat trinket. trinket. And then, like I said, they've got the the modest boobies. They're well, covered they're up. Modest. They are not modest. They are high knees out. Um, the salt and pepper shaker. For sure. And then, that's, what else do we have down here? The little baby in the boot. And the, oh my gosh, that's fun too. What could I help with here? I am just loving. There we have Glowing Gertie. She's a lighter. She's a ginger lighter. And then we've got our friend, Blazing Betty. Those are fun. They're lighters. They're desk lighters. Wow. They are... Oh, $185. I have never seen them before. Those are amazing. And then I love the Lefton um, Relish. He's $375. And then we've got the um, Pixie Wear, Holt Howard. Look at this. Look at the saccharin. It's better for me. It's $265. It is on sale. But it's so fun seeing 
It's so yeah. fun okay. seeing Before these things. Kind of like feedback. Yeah, I got and the mayonnaise. Oh, these are just so fun. See, I love them. And then down here, we've got a lot of the blackware cats. But look at the salt and pepper shaker with the little, um, the little fish bowls. Wow. Oh, it's so amazing. This stuff just makes me happy. It makes me happy. And this cute little Lipper and Man. It's very much, much looks like a Lefton or Holt Howard piece, but it is made by Lipper and Man. It's four dollars. I like it. It says "Hello, I'm something," but hello from no. Oh, hello from Colorado. I don't know. It has like a little decal sticker on it, but we're gonna get that too. Okay, in the next booth, just the next booth over, I have sold this little guy, this little snowman guy. Um, he's $48, but look at Santa riding that candy cane. Some of the prices in this booth are a little pricey. I love Santa. I love Santa? Where? Oh, wow. He has seen some things. But these Holt Howard hula hoop, Mr. and Mrs. Claus, they have hula hoops around their waist. They're $85, and I love the Noel. So these are great. And we've got some lady head vases. 75, 38 for the small ones, 48 for this little one. Lots of fun things. And look at the poodle head vases. $135. And the little, the little dinosaurs down here. And all of the beautiful big light. Beautiful, beautiful things. Beautiful. I just found a little. Oh, you know what? What's this little guy? This is plastic. $45. But I've only seen the ceramic ones. That seems a little much for that. But $65. $68. Mark said, Oh my goodness. Oh my. Atlanta. These are fun. Look at the anthropomorphic. Look at the pickles. $35. Yeah, these are, I can't get any of these for resale, but wow, they're so fun to see. The little nodders back there, the little nodder elephants. Oh my gosh. The states. Look at the monkey swinging from the tree. Now, I've had these egg. These egg ones with the diamond eyes, the little prixies here with the dice. These are just like so much fun. Oh, there's boobies back there. Oh no. Tea bag holders. Mm. <laughs> this is, but this one will hold your cooking spoon. I'll hold the spoon. I'll hold your cooking spoon for $45. What do we got? See, Jeffrey is here too, so we have to beat Jeffrey to all of the things. We all went separate ways. So there's no pressure. This is a big enough place. We all love shopping together, but you know, it's just kind of a fun, I don't want to say competition, but it's it's fun to, sometimes you see what other people in your life, you got what they got, and you're like, oh man. But it's all in good fun. We all like, we all like doing this this is a lot of fun for us okay and there is of course you know we got to see him that we're that we're done with him this little elephant cookie jar he's 55 dollars. he's a lot of fun too and i'm like really into the books and the ephemera lately the biggity bangity school bus i've, I've got that one Look who's here. It's Emma and Colin. They're going shopping too. Hi, Emma. Hi. <laughs> I'm going to go in and see what's in this case. This looks like a fun... Ooh, this is really pretty before I even get to the case. For $25. This art glass. Um, May... No, I don't know what that says. Windily. 2009 but it's very pretty how it looks like it has these birds in flight i think and then we've got some books we have sleeping beauty johnny and the birds i wonder how much the books are let's just look on the inside 
It's three dollars. That's not bad. Johnny and the birds. Peter Rabbit. What's growing here? Oh, what is growing there? Mark, what's growing on this book? That looks like a... No. <laughs> no, okay. Peter Rabbit. <laughs> ducktails. We don't want ducktails. But yeah, I don't know why. It's like I've been just so drawn to books and ephemera this trip. A visit to Disneyland. Whitman. Oh, Herbie the Love Bug, Belling the Cat, Pick Piddle. A pickle for a nickel. Hmm. All right, I was walking over here to look in this case because I saw these. They're very clown-like, but they're gobble ghosts. And I kind of like them. So, Mark, do you see someone with a jacket on? Because I there's something in this case that I want. I want to look and see. Yeah, I do want those. The little gobble ghosts. They're nine dollars for the pair. And and they are West Germany, so they are the older ones. I tend to just buy the ones that were made in West Germany. <laughs> You're a little doggy here. All right, so I'm going to check down this aisle here. Michael just found some amazing Lepton Angels. Amazing like Le Le Lepton Angels. You'll have to go to his video if you want to see what they are. Go over to his video and see. Here we've got the Royal Baruth Lobster. Um, <laughs> All that copper luster up there is beautiful especially for this time of year in the fall. I tend to really buy a lot of things seasonally. So like, I'm not really looking for like bright colors and fun things. I mean, I'm always looking for bright colors and fun things, but I'm looking for more muted earthy tones for this time of year. Like this fella. <laughs> oh, he's sticky. Why are you sticky, sir? Okay, we're gonna leave you right there. Seeing this girl, she's $18. She is, I think that she is Probably a hull, but she's very Ginger Rogers-esque. She looks to be in very good condition. Here I was just talking about, oh, I'm not buying bright colors and I'm just buying earthy tones for things for fall, but man, I don't know. I really kind of like her. She's a planter. She's very Art Deco. I don't know. I have to think about her. She's very haunting. Mmm. I'm gonna think about her. Found this little baby. He is he's sixteen dollars. He is bisque, but oh my god, change my diaper. <laughs> oh, I love it, but it's sixteen dollars. It's it's a little bisque baby pin cushion, super cute. I see a troll. What? Thirty five dollars for the Norfin troll? Oh, wow a moment just to say how love how much love I feel in my heart that my daughter is now enjoying going to antique malls and shopping and looking for things it makes my heart filled with love and joy and happiness all right we found this beautiful case here but I am gonna get this Viking compote it is $38 but I just love it it does have the Viking sticker on it so, and then we're looking at, Colin's trying to make up his mind. And I told him if he isn't going to get them, I am. These mushroom shade um, candlestick holders are $20. You know what? I think it's each. I think it's each. There's only one tag, though. There's only one tag. Oh, that's true. Well, that's what I'm saying. If you don't get them, I will. All right. I am seeing a fun little decanter with the shot glasses. Look at how fun he is. He's got his cups, he's $19. He's so much fun, look. And you can store your booze in his body. He's fun. Oh, here we've got a little baby for $2. And it says 1929.30 New Year's Eve. Well, for $2, baby. 
you're gonna go home with me and then this is I was Michael and I were just looking at there's a purple um, paperweight this is very similar to the one that I have at home that I think is great for Halloween decor it looks like a looks like a crystal ball so those are those are fun there too but look Michael I got a baby for two dollars Emma is beckoning. Oh, wait a minute, though, Emma. <gasps> what? Okay, I'm getting these. These are these vintage Christmas tree toppers with a ceramic head. I love these. They look fun. This one is $5 each. So, no, $5 for both. And then that one's $3. So, we're going to get you two, girl. We're going to get you all. All the girls. No, we're not getting the hobo because he looks like a clown. But we are going to get these three triplets up here. All right, I am going to get this little GE Heavenly Angel. She does work and she is $14. There's no readout or no barcode on her. So I'm going to get her. I also picked up a couple of Scotch tins for me. And then I just am really drawn to this little girl. She's $6. She's a just a sweet little gold angel. And I'm looking at some more Christmas. Because you know Christmas is coming. It's coming. <laughs> these little, I like these little beaded angels. She's $3. So I'm going to get her. And this one's just cracking me up. She looks like she's going to like cause major ha havoc and chaos in the world. She's three fifty two. I just kind of like her. I <laughs> don't know why. I'm going to get her too. And we've got the little beaded angels. But I don't like that they don't have faces. I don't know. We've got the putts houses. They are $7 each, which is not a bad price. I like these guys, too. I have this set here. I've got them. And then I was over here looking at this guy. He is a $49. He is not Holt Howard. Um, my, my bucket list is the winking eye tall... Holt Howard picture. That's that's not him, but it's it's close, but no cigar. And then this little sweetie up here is two fit two fifty. Looks like a little pixie, so I'm gonna get her. And these are Wizard. They were like air fresheners. And you could stick them in your car or in your closet or something. Those were big at one time. These little girls right here, these are Lefton. Um, it's $10 for the salt and pepper shakers. They're just little little winter girls. And then let's see. Mark's pointing out these guys. We I've sold those a couple times before. Um, but it's kind of one of those things that I've sold them a couple times and I, they're great. They're made in Japan. But I don't know. I don't think I'm going to get them today. This is a, a, a snowman clown, which is frightening. I, I'm not real big on snowmen. I don't know why. I like Santas. But he's a snowman and he's a clown. So that's that, That's all for me. But look at this reindeer. I'm like into this beaded stuff. Look at the reindeer. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. How many reindeer in seven Santa sleigh? Eight. So we're missing Rudolph. We're missing Rudolph. So I think I'm gonna get the I'm gonna get the deer. I'm gonna get the deer. All the all my friends are buying all this beautiful art glass. Although I have been buying some art glass, but I am buying the beaded deer for three dollars each. They're great cutest little swung base I have ever seen. It's $6 and it glows like the Dickens. Look at that. Oh, I love that. I also got a I also got a Santa mug. He has a great face. I always I'm kind of picky with these now. I'll just look at the face and if I like the face real well. And then I also got these. And I, there was a few more over there and I got this one simply because I already have this one. So this one will be for resale, a little, two little cupies hugging. All right, so here is a fun booth, and I'm seeing lots of fun little things. There's $12.95 for these little salt and pepper sacred chefs. But I was looking at him. He's $24.95. He's fun. 
And these little guys, he's like, I don't know. I don't know. I'll hold your spoons, though. $12.95. Oh. I think at this point, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up. There will be several videos at this particular antique mall because it is just so huge and will probably be here most of the day. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up. But as always, if you saw anything that you were interested in, you can send me an email, thrifterjunkervintagehunter at gmail.com, and I will let you know if it's available. You had seen everything that I bought today. So today's video is going to be ending tomorrow's video will be tomorrow and i am going to start fresh we're going to start a new video part two will be coming up tomorrow i hope that you will join us and i'll see you later i'm just a girl a wonderful girl the sweetest one in town can search for miles around and no one like me can be found i've got a smile a wonderful smile and a certain little